All right, so we got Kimiri reveal trailer. Let's get to video. Now I think I remember this one. Now I think this is actually um, I think this was like designed by like one girl, right? I can't lie, I remember this trailer. Hey, this is hard. Hey, she, hey, she went crazy on this one. She went crazy. This was ridiculous. Boy, that is hard. Boy, listen. She, listen, y'all. Y'all, listen. Listen, y'all. I promise you. Now, I know, like, I think this is from, like, the Game Awards channel. Who, what channel is this from? This is from somebody else's, uh, I think this is from, like, the Game Awards channel or the, or IGN's channel, whatever. Um, but, yeah, that's why, I like, it, it looked, like, a little, like, I downloaded it in 720. It looked a little blurry. But, listen, in the Game Awards, I was watching that thing in 4K. I promise you. That girl that designed this, she didn't throw me no dollars. She didn't throw me nothing. I promise you, bro. The way this was, like, designed and stuff like that, bro, I think she actually came out after this trailer, um, I think uh, Jeff introduced her after this this trailer uh, came out. Whatever she was all bubbly and stuff like that, and um, but yeah, man, listen, this is fire, bro. For her to design this by herself, bro, props will be given, bro. I told you guys a lot of times, bro. A lot of these in, uh, indie games and a lot of these um, games that were created by like you know small companies or like or even by like a few people, bro. Bro, these be the games that blow up, bro. I promise you. It's not just always like the big, you know, companies like Ubisoft, EA, and stuff like that. Like, respect to them. I, I give the utmost respect to them, man. They they definitely carried my childhood. But uh, but at the end of the day, man, these small games, you know, as you get older, like, especially like for me, like if you're ever like interested in the gaming scene, and obviously, you know, we got so many more people, you know, trying to uh, get into like the gaming scene every single year, which is nice. Um, if you're ever interested, uh, interested in the gaming scene, and you're like a little older, and you know, obviously, because all the little kids, you know, they don't really care about the whole indie games unless it's like really popular. But when you, you know, when you're a little older, bro, and you're in the gaming scene, you start to appreciate a lot of the people, a lot of like the indie games and like the small, like the small, small, small developers that like create their games, stuff like that, man. Because those be the games. Like for example, um, the game Only Up. I think that was created by one guy. I think one guy created that game. Uh, if I'm wrong, I'm wrong. Make sure you guys correct me down in the comment system down below. But I think it was just like one guy in like his team. Or I don't know if it was just him by himself. But yeah, man, he he created that game, and it bro, it went crazy. And I think he took it down. Uh, for, I, I forget for what reason. But um, but yeah, man, a lot of these popular games that that we have today or that we had, um, were created by you know people by by small. Uh, developers by one or two people like it's just crazy how like how how big games can get like you don't like you really don't need a big development company now i mean it would be smart for you to you know if, if you are a big game a, a big gaming uh company sorry i can't speak if you are a big gaming company you know then you know if you want to create like a big quality game then obviously you, you know you would need a big team but if you're just starting out bro you don't need you know you don't you know, you could just, you can have your own idea, bro, and you can create it, bro. So, I just want to give you guys a little inspiration right there, you know. A little Mr. King Indie inspiration, though. Um, other than that, yeah, but this trailer did look nice, man. Um, now, I don't remember. Yeah, I would say I don't remember them giving us, like, a, a like a release date about it. Um, I mean, hopefully, hopefully she can, you know, put it out because a lot of the games, you know, that don't. Usually, a lot of games that don't really, like, have, like, a year or, like, a, or, like, a, um. Or like a projected like year or projected month to come out. They usually, I mean, some of them don't come out at all. Some of them, you know, they lose the money. Some of them, you know, they, they can't, like, they, they just fall apart. You know, um, some of them lose their, uh, like, their investors and stuff like that. So, you know, you, you kind of have to pray to, like, you know, to, to, to keep this thing running. Um, but, yeah, so hopefully, I, I pray that this comes out, bro, because this game looks absolutely fire, bro. Other than that, man, I'll see you guys at the full next time I'm out. And, uh,